This is the last video showing Sister Gloria Narvaez. The nun was kidnapped on February 7, 2017, in Mali. Not much has been known of her situation since. The last news we received were from a letter I got from the International Red Cross in May. They told me she was in good health, but that they had moved her to another group because of the liberation of French woman Sophie Petronan. They sent her to another group that is farther away, but her health is good. Edgar Narvaez is asking anyone who will listen to do something to save his sister. The nun is also a nurse, part of the congregation of the Franciscan Sisters of Mary Immaculate. Al-Qaeda handed her over to the JNIM, whose name means Group for the Support of Islam and Muslims. The Colombian government resumed negotiations in March, but a few weeks later they were unexpectedly interrupted. They were there in March, April, May, a month and a half, when the captain called me and said, we're going back to Colombia. I asked why. No idea. Who gave the order? We don't know. This pause in the search for his sister worries his family and the congregation, because the 59-year-old nun has been held captive for four and a half years, and her health has deteriorated. This is one way to make the whole world see, so that the national government here in Colombia realizes that my sister was left alone, completely alone and abandoned, and we're counting on everyone's prayers and on God to free her. Sister Gloria's family remembers how a terrorist group in the same country freed an Italian missionary, Father Pierluigi Macali, after holding him hostage for two years, and that alone gives them cause for hope.